Hello, it's Jenna here. Welcome to my place. A beautiful day. Valentine's Day is approaching. When we can remember more clearly what a gift we have in our partner. I thank my husband for his love, for being patient, kind, tolerant, supporting me, praying for me. I really appreciate that he takes the time to walk and talk with me almost every day. I love you, my dear, and I'm looking forward to today's walk. Today we'll paint a Valentine's greeting card with watercolors. I will use only two basic colors, gray and pink in different shades. Okay, maybe a little blue-gray, but these two colors go very well together. They are subtle and complement each other. First, I will make the first layer of individual flower petals and leaves on the dry paper. While the petals are still wet, I add a darker color that will blend into the petals and create a pretty center of the flower. Later, when the petals are dry, I will paint the details with an even darker color. Everyone longs for love, to be loved, but only God offers a love that fills us completely. God's love is even greater than partner love. God loves more, better, perfectly. God gave us the most precious gift. In the Bible it's written, this is how God showed his love for us. He sent his only son into the world so that we could have eternal life because of him. We did not love God first, rather he loved us first. He sent his son to die to take away our sins. This shows how much he loved us. So dear friends, we should all love each other. Nobody has ever seen God, but if we love each other, he really lives in us, and he can love people completely in us. Perhaps we could use Valentine's Day to please not only our partner, but also other people, for example parents, siblings, friends. Even just such a card can show other people that they are worthy of love. The frame on the card doesn't have to be a perfect line. In this case, it suits me better, loser like this, with a dashed line. In the middle of the card, between the flowers, I want to write God loves me. I want that when the recipient looks at it, that it speaks directly to him or her. God loves me. But it could also be written there, God loves you, or a specific name, but you can certainly come up with your own text. I write the inscription lightly in grey and then highlight the individual parts of the letters with a darker grey. When writing letters, it's necessary to use the brush very lightly and precisely. If we don't succeed with flowers and leaves, it can be camouflaged somehow, but it's worse with letters. If you like this card, use the idea and make it your own. I wish you success and a beautiful Valentine's Day. Bye!